Malto. Malto is a, a game, it's like a bingo game. And we use multiplication. So what we need is, what you need is, a bingo sheet like this. I attached this underneath this video so you can download it. Or you can simply draw uh, four by four squares on a piece of paper. So, same as a normal bingo, you need to fill each box with numbers. Now, what type of numbers? So, I have these multiplication sheet. You have two numbers, right? And the first number is either 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, or 9. And the second number is the same. You'll see one zero zero one two three four five six seven eight or nine. So I'm going to pause the video. What is the smallest number you can use, and what is the largest number you can use? Let's pause the video. So the smallest number you can use is zero. The largest number you can use is eighty one. You can use any number between 0 and 81 inclusive means you can use 0 you can use 81 let's fill these 16 boxes with 16 different numbers you cannot use a number more than once the smallest number is 0 largest number is 81 let's pause the video so have you completed your bingo sheet now i quickly explain how you win malto if you get uh, the numbers in the row vertically, horizontally, diagonally, or you fill all the four corners, you win. Or you can call that multo. So let's pause the video. Is your bingo sheet a multo sheet? filled with good numbers. What makes numbers good? Let's pause the video. You can say it, you can think about it, or you can write down your opinion. Let's pause the video. So to see if you have good numbers or not, one of the ways to find out is actually to play. So let's play the first game, ready. 7 times 8, 56. I don't have it, so I cannot circle the number. If you see, if you have 56, you circle the number. Let's keep up. Second number is 4 times 0. It's 0. I don't have 0. 0 times 2. 0. I don't have that. Next number is two nines, 18. I don't have it. Five eights, 40. I don't have it. Six twos, 12. I have it. Seven twos, 14. I'll stop this game now. Seems like my bingo sheet or multi sheet is not a good one. Can you see any numbers on my multi sheet which should not be on that bingo sheet or multi sheet? Let's pause the video. You can say it, you can write it, or you can think about it. Let's pause the video. Have you realized? Number like 50, to make 50, that's five times 10. Remember my multi sheet, multi cards, does not have five times 10. The number only goes up to nine. So five times 10 never happens in this game. So this number is a bad number. Same as 13, that's one times 13. 13 is not in here and there's no other way making 13 
apart from 1 times 13, so this is a bad one. 8 times 10 doesn't happen. I can do 4 times 20 to make 80, but still, I cannot make it using two numbers smaller than 10. This is gone. 7 times 35, this can happen. 1 times 3 can happen. But 1 times 19 is not possible in this game. In this game. Let's pause the video. Can you make a better multi game sheet? Well, I changed my multi sheet. These are, these are the numbers that can happen when I pick a card from here. Now, have you got a better multi sheet? Let's play the first round. Are you ready? Three nines, 27. Let's circle it. Three zeros, zero. I don't have it. One times zero is zero. One times six is six. One times nine is nine. Now, if this is too fast, you can pause the video. Seven six is a forty two. I don't have it. Five seven a thirty five. I don't have it. Nine five is a forty five. I don't have it. Two zero is zero. This is the third time I'm getting zero. Five two is a ten. How are you going on your sheet? Four sevens are twenty eight. I don't have it. Nine eights are seventy two. I don't have it. I think you're winning. Eight fours are thirty two. I don't have it. Nine twos are eighteen. Yes. Two nines are eighteen. Again. It seems like some numbers happen a few times. Five ones one. Five ones are five. There you go. <coughs> zero twos, zero again. I wonder why there's so many zeros. Seven nines are sixty three. Nope. Seven eights are fifty six. If I get a three, I get the multi. Four eights are thirty two. Hmm. Three threes are nine. Nine again. I've already used it. Five fives are twenty-five. I don't have it. Four zero is zero again. That's annoying. Nine threes are twenty-seven. Five fours are twenty. I wonder if you have already got the multi. You can go for a second multi. Six six are thirty six. Oh, I can go this way. If I get eight, I might get a multi. Seven one is seven one to seven. Hmm. One times one is one. Eight six is a forty eight. How many multis have you got? Four five is a twenty. Again. Eight eight is a sixty four. Mm -mm. Mix it up. Six twos are twelve. 
Hey, I have 12. Molto. This is Molto for me. I have one Molto. How many have you got? I'll give you another number. Zero five is zero again. Hmm. How about three fives of fifteen? I don't have fifteen. Shall I give you another one? One three is three. That's my second motto. Last number. Five eight to forty. I have one. So let's stop the game here. I have pulled out so many numbers, but I only got two multos. I realized there's so many zeros that came out from this box. I wonder why. Let's pause the video. What numbers are good numbers to use on the multi sheet? And where should I place those numbers? Let's pause the video. So have you realized that there's so many zeros happening in this game? I'll show you the chart. Look at the chart. You can see many zeros happening on the sheet. And if you look at this sheet, maybe you can see some numbers appear so many times. They are the good numbers to use on the multo. So I'm going to pause the video again. You can refill your multo sheet using those good numbers. And you think of where you can put those numbers, such as zero. You can even have a look at the chart again. I'll attach the chart on this underneath this video. See how many zeros even appear. So let's pause the video. Let's refill a new multi sheet with great numbers and where you're going to put that, those numbers. Let's pause the video. So if I were you, I'm going to put a zero first. Where is the best part, best box to put a zero in? What do you think? I'm going to put the zero here. Because you can go this way, you can go this way, you can go diagonal. Or, remember you can win using four corners too. When you look at the chart, there are so many 12s. Because I can make 2 times 6, 3 times 4. 4 times 3, 6 times 2. There's so many 12s can happen. So 12 shouldn't be here. 12 should be maybe on the corner again. I know there are many 18s. 2 times 9, 9 times 2. 3 times 6, 6 times 3. 18. 24. 3 times 8. 8 times 3, you can see the pattern now. 6 times 4, 4 times 6. 24 is a good number. I'm going to pause the video again. You can fix your multi sheet. Let's pause the video. Let's start. Let's see if we win or I win this time. 7 fours are 24. No, 28. Next number, 7963. I don't have it. Hope you do. 63 can happen, 79s or 97. Not a bad number. 6 8 to 48. 6 8 and 8 sixes will be 48. One three is three, or three one three. Hmm. Next, seven one, seven. Nine fives are forty five. Hmm. 
There are three, zero. I knew zero would happen. This is better than last time. Two sixes, 12. Well, I am doing well. Six two is a 12. Expected, because there's so many ways to get 12. Seven three is a 21. I don't have many odd numbers. I wonder why. Zero five is far, zero. Expected. Nine twos are 18. I wonder how many ways to get 18. Seven eights are 56. Hmm. Two twos are four. I forgot to use a four. Silly me. Because four, you can do one fours, four ones, and two twos. Eight zeros, zero. Five sixes are 30. Nine ones, nine. Nine sixes. 54. 9 times 0 equals 0. There's so many zeros, right? 6 9s are 54. Again. I wonder if 54 is a good number. 5 threes are 15. That is my motto. That's how I keep playing. Let's see if I get an 8. I'll give me that multi or 24. 24 will give me that multi as well as the four corners too. Come on, 24. Four fives of 20. How are you going? Three threes and nine. If I get the number again, that's a good sign. I'm using the right numbers. One six is Six. Ooh. So close. How are you going? How many multis have you got? Zero twos. Zero. Zero twos. Zero. Five one. Five minus one equals five. Five fives are twenty five. I bet you have like five multis by now. Two nines are eighteen. I've already used it. So, let's do two more. Five twos are ten. Oof. Last number. Of course, it's a zero. So, this multo, I have only one multo line. How many have you got? You can play this game. I'm going to attach the multo sheet. So you can play multi at home, or the, if you're a teacher, you can then print out and you can play this with your students as well. Hope you had fun.